Hello there, people. Welcome back to the Eagle Byte 83 channel. Whoa, whoa. Uh, where the past never dies. I'm, of course, your host, Eagle Byte. And tonight we are continu continuing the adventure in Nexus, the Jupiter incident. Very late now. It's actually already uh, half past midnight. This was all just because I decided there's been a very cold front over Scandinavia the last couple of months um, as opposed to everywhere else in the world for some reason the scientists don't really know why uh, but there's been like a blue bubble all over Scandinavia so where whereas there's been like a heat wave going on and elsewhere in the world um, now in November and December we've had it pretty cold it's actually the first snow came already in November, which rarely happens these days. So, and now it's like, it, it's like during the night, it's like minus 10 Celsius around that. So, and even during the days, it's not really above zero. So it's very, very cold right now. Uh, and while I was doing, while it was going to be that like that because they actually said that it's going to get milder next week uh, I decided tonight to actually defrost my freezer it was something I had to do and I kind of figured it I kind of realized it too late today I had already planned to do it today but I was planning on doing it earlier so uh, it got pushed up to about streaming time so I, I was like god damn it and then I didn't really feel comfortable streaming while I was doing it, so that took priority tonight. But I'm still gonna be playing one or two missions in Nexus just to just to progress in that game. Um, so let's do that, and uh, uh, and uh, yeah, let's go for it. Here's a lot of ice. Actually, the ice survived outside. Um, I love that. You could actually put it out there and it didn't, like, melt or anything. Hey! Bart Knocker! <laughs> Welcome back, man. Welcome back, Farty. Nice to see you, as always. Yes, we will. We will. Um, last episode, we got a hold of a specific weapon that will be working against the Mechanoids. But now we've lost contact with the Alpha Gate leading back to Earth, which is where the Mechanoids uh, have been enslaving humanity. So we're going there to investigate. Nice to see you, man. How are you? Everything good, I hope? And also, have you checked out the latest uh, Bolt Gun um, uh, episode? <laughs> we did do this, right? Oh shit, 34, really? Ah, we got the energy skeeter, nice. It's flo flooding, so I took it that day off. Okay, okay, cool. Just flooding, okay. <laughs> uh, okay, you know what? We're putting on the laser globe right now. Thank you very much. Uh, there we go. Precision, yeah, exactly. Thank you. Thank you. Squadrons, nah. Everything's looking good. Yeah, I don't think we're... Pulsar missile. Tremor torpedo. Nah. That's gonna be... That, that's better. What the hell? Wait, did they remove the battleship from our, our fleet? What the hell? They removed the Guardian? I thought that... Wait a minute. 
That was supposed to stay with our fleet. Why is it not with us anymore? I mean, it says we have a new addition to our fleet, the battleship Guardian. Now we're really badass. As with the others, she'll be with us for the remainder of the game, so treat her well. To my recollection, we did not... She did not, like, explode or anything. Uh... So I don't understand why she's not here. That's very strange. Oh, you've seen some of it, okay. Yeah, I, I I, just, I was just asking because I, I spent a lot of time talking to you. So I was expecting like, you know, some text in my DMs again. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, you know what? Never mind. Let's just go with it. They ordered that I return home. I realize that the colony is not my real home, but a weary spacefarer like myself needs all the solace he can get. Home sounds so much more comforting than Central Command, even if the name is a lie. Noah's scientists towed the body of the recently defeated Locust Queen to their orbital laboratories and pulled it to pieces. Apparently, their efforts are already bearing fruit. In addition to discovering the secret of the energy Skeeter weapon, they claim to have made several important breakthroughs as a result of their findings. The Angel Wing has returned so that the prototype anti-mechanoid weapon can be mounted on the ship. As for our future, returning to Earth no longer seems like a suicide mission. However, the odds are still heavily stacked against us. Angel has reassured us that our chances of defeating the entity grow larger by the day. Naturally, she is central to our success. But can her we trust her? Her personality has undergone rapid changes since she occupied and ultimately merged with the weakened mechanoid body. It frightens me to say it, but it is almost as if she is gradually becoming a mechanoid herself. But this is no time for pre-fight jitters. Even if I knew for certain that she was untrustworthy, there would be little I could do to oppose her. The Vardrags don't see it that way. We're starting to run into problems. The Angel Wing has undergone many changes. Despite our best efforts to keep the Vardrags in the dark, sooner or later, they were bound to find out. Our new power terrifies them. They are utterly controlled by their primal fear of the Mechanoids. I'm afraid that the time draws near where they will demand the destruction of Angel and the Angel Wing. Never! I could never agree to this. Tensions are already fraught. Such an impasse could only lead to open conflict. In order to prevent the situation deteriorating, my childhood friend, Rob Scheinman, has traveled to the main Vardrex system, hoping that a personal visit may achieve better results. On my part, I have initiated negotiations with the Vardrag garrison, defending the Alpha Gate, requesting permission to pass through. As I expected, they avoided the issue on several occasions, but recently they have stopped responding to our communications altogether. Unable to account for this behavior, we have dispatched one of our frigates to the Alpha Gate to find out what is going on. Just a frigate? Oh, that's... That's not going to be enough, dude. Uh, I was so late today. Yes, hello, Sassy. Welcome back. Yeah, I just said um, I did not plan on uh, broadcasting this late because uh, I was uh, I was set to do it like, you know, uh, during the more normal time zone or time slot. But uh, I realized that I was going to uh, defrost my freezer today, and so that took priority. Uh, especially now, during nighttime, it's, it's actually very cold outside. Um, I took matter... Uh, like, I, I... You know, I just seized the opportunity to do it. Which is very good, because my freezer was, like, over-stuffed with, you know, like, snow and ice. It was like, okay... Dude, we need to really defrost you, <laughs> you know? 
And since, like, the temperature is gonna reach more mild degrees after this week, I was like, okay, let's, let's just do it now. Otherwise, I'm gonna forget anyway. So, yeah, right now it's 10 to 1 a.m. I might not do that much. I might do one or two missions here, and then I'll just, you know, wrap it up. But I felt like I wanted to do something tonight, at least. Um... Here's. Dear Admiral Cromwell, the Valdrag station, the gatekeeper, is not answering our hails, and we have lost contact with our scout ship. Put your fleet on alert and find out what's going on. Alpha Gate is leading to the Soul System. That's danger territory right now. Yeah. All right. Let's go for it. Yeah, I did. I did that. I put in two pots of uh, boiling water in inside the freezer. Alpha gate. So that's the. St that's the fortress that is uh, blocking the wormhole. <laughs> the wormhole back home. There's a lot of Vardrag ships Sir, here. We've got the Fox Scout frigate on visual. It's been destroyed. Lieutenant, hail the Vardrags. What did I tell I don't you? I expect guys? we'll get much of an answer. Look, Rear Admiral. Oh, oh shit. Annoyed? What the hell is it doing here? Does it matter? Let's get the hell out of here before it pounces on us. We've already got one. We're not planning on opening a menagerie. We're not going <laughs> anywhere. We have to find out what's happened here. Think of it as an opportunity to test our energy skeeter weapon. Yeah. I knew it. Typical. Shut well, up, the sweet order. in their bodies at the moment, correct? They are inside the ships. They took control of the Vardrag ships? Why aren't they attacking us? Until we are identified by a mechanoid as an enemy, they will not waste unnecessary energy chasing us down. What are they still doing here? They must have taken these ships for a reason. Perhaps they could not completely take over the guidance systems. There might be something in that. The Vardrags are tightly bound to their machines. The link is almost... organic. Theories are no good to me. We need rock-solid information. I want to know if the mechanoids are heading for Noah Colony. All right, let's scan the ships. Let's scan the closest one, the Pathfinder. Uh, actually, let's just send in the the angel, angel wing for now. Affirmative. Let's keep everybody else in uh, in uh, reserve. I haven't even apologized yet. Oh yeah, g good. Good that you... Yeah, 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 I get you. <laughs> You're learning. <laughs> Alright. We'll keep the Avalanche and the Brutus and the Sparta in reserve. Right now. Yeah. So, how many ships did I have? Oh shit, there's three mechanoid bodies. Ooh, maybe we should scan the box as well. Let's do let's do that first. Wait, is that a good idea? I mean, okay, yeah, sure. Let's scan our own destroyed frigate first. Let's see, that one is 10,000 kilometers away. That was 14,000, okay, all right. Very well. So this mission is mostly about gathering information. I do not like the, the fact that we're passing this close to a mechanoid. 
Almost 5,000 kilometers. This is this is not good. Uh, my day's been good. Uh, I helped my mother. I drilled some screws into her wall. It was like drywall. It, no, it was um, like concrete. So it was re very hard to do that. She wanted to uh, put some uh, curtains up or whatever it was. Gatekeeper. <coughs> Box. What is that? Oh, that's another mechanoid. Okay. I wonder who got paid to sing like this when they made the game. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I have a drill. Uh, scan it. No, scan it. Really? I can't scan it? Okay, there's nothing to scan, apparently. Alright, let's scan the Pathfinder, then. No, wait. What are you doing? F10. Okay. Yeah, apparently it's impossible to scan the fox. Alright. Understood. Alright, all engines reverse. I like the look of the new Angel Wing when they when it merged with the mechanoid. It looks much more menacing now. Scanning, scanning. Bar drag theory. All right. Party, how's your not day been, by the way? Hey, you too, Sasi. What have you been doing today? The Vardrag shield is hindering my scan. I think there may be survivors on the ship. Vardrags, raptors, or something else. I don't know. I do not recommend dispatching our commandos in any case. They won't make it through the shield. Well, can't we just, like, bring down the shield? Wait. Let's save the game here. Uh... Ego 8 in progress, yes. Okay, save. There we go. Uh... Affirmative. What actually happens we if I do that? We are under attack. Yeah, I don't think that was a good idea. No, okay, okay, yeah. Now they're sending out the mechan- Yeah, we should not present ourselves as a threat. Damn it. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna sleep soon, so I say goodnight in advance if I fall asleep before- Okay. Well, sleep tight, have a good night, and uh, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Uh, oh yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna actually gonna have some company here, so uh, I'll talk to you when I can. Uh, same with the stream, I don't know when I'm gonna be able to stream, but it's kinda like the same as always. Uh, just hanging with the wife and painting stuff. You know, I would like for somebody to paint my figurine, my talisman figurines. At least my talisman figurines for the expansion, the Reaper. Because that's still, like, in the, the boxes. Are you feeling up to the challenge? <laughs> Working how the dogs feel, fell asleep after they picked up the dogs. Okay. Your leg is hurting? Oh, shit. Don't you have a bathtub? Try to immerse yourself into, like, hot water. Warning. We are under attack. Oh, wait. Maybe we're... Maybe that's scripted. Maybe we can't avoid that. Yeah, it looks like we can't avoid that. 
Yes, sir. Yeah. Sir, one of the mechanoids has become active. Excellent. Time for us to see how effective our energy skater weapons are. Yeah, sure. Why not? Energy skater. Understood. Oh, nice. Oh, you don't have a bathtub. Okay. Burn. Burn. My energy's lost, dude. How do you. Why, what happened to your leg? How did you uh, hurt your leg? Nice work, people. Let's lure the others out, too. We'll nail every last one of the bastards. You mustn't underestimate the mechanoids. They'll recharge themselves by using the weapons on the Vardrak ships. We can't defeat them on our own. Evacuate. Damn these godforsaken machines. Rear Admiral, please. Listen to me just this once. Let's find out what we need to know and get out of here. Apparently we can't You, We're not using our energy shells on that one, so never mind them. All right, Star Blazers next. Yeah. Aye, aye, sir. No, wait. Understood. Come on. Understood. Yeah, just Warning. Shield oh, shit. down. Turn around. Over the star and blazer. Oh, it's not Warning. attacking. Shield down. Okay, it's not attacking us when the shield is down, though. Warning. Shield down. Eh, no worries. Nah, just focus. Warning. Shield down. Oh, something's shooting at the mechanoid. Really? Oh, it's using the... Uh, ah, it's... Uh, that's interesting. The Vardrag ships are being controlled by the mechanoids. But the mechanoid body is out here trying to attack us. Now, we do know that the mechanoids absorb energies when you fire on it, except with the energy skeeter weapon. So now the mechanoids are like recharging their own body by using the Vardrag ships to fire on their own body. That's actually kind of cool. Uh, well, I can paint them, but getting them here then with it. Yeah, I know, I know. I was just toying with the idea, you know. Warning. Shield down. Affirmative. Target hides special information. Yeah. Read. Scanning for new data. It's not firing at us though. Like it, the the mechanoid's body itself. Usually, it only fires if we get it get the shield up for some it reason. Seems and then like it, the mechanoids have encountered serious problems in trying to seize control of the Vardrak computer system. Oh really? Interesting. The 
cutting-edge technology and countless security algorithms don't seem to be posing many difficulties. However, a central organic mind integrates and manages the various systems. It seems that the mechanoids were unprepared for something of this nature. Oh! So they're great at taking over, like, completely uh, electronic, computerized systems. But if it's a cyborg entity, they're not really... They, yeah, they're not equipped for that. That's why the ships are immobile, and I expect that they have yet to perfect their control over the weapon systems. Warning. Shield down. Interesting. Alright, let's scan this one. Understood. Warning. Shield down. Yeah, but we're not taking damage to the hull. That's interesting. Or do I with the pain that radiates up? Yeah, how did you hurt your leg? What happened? Warning. Shield down. So far, it's only one mechanoid as well. There's three mechanoid bodies, but only one is active. I don't know why that is. Target hides special information. <laughs> Read one up. Oh, sorry. I have this big wound under my heel. Uh, and it has begun to go up in the shins. Oh, maybe you should go to the doctor and check that out. I mean, you can't use your feet if you have a wound there. Finally answer your question, Rear Admiral. I have managed to infiltrate the presiding mechanoid's comm channel. What was the question? You know. As soon as system integration is complete, the ships will head to the Vardrag's home system. Oh, what they're doing with the ships, okay. Uh as soon as this integration is complete, the ships will head to the Vardrag. Okay. Lieutenant, pass that information on to Central Command immediately. Copy that, sir. I have sent a report. We've got what we came for, Rear Admiral. Unless you fancy a bit of sightseeing, let's beat feet. Given the preponderance of forces, we could never win a battle here. We ought to leave. Understood. We're, go right, We're going. We're going to. Out of here. Good work, everybody. Task complete. Scientific analysis complete. All right, we're getting out of here. IP drive. Aye, aye, sir. Let's get the hell out of here. Woohoo! Oh, nice. I got all the secondary objectives as well. Uh, evaluation. The next target of the mechanoid infected ships is Chakris, the Vardrag's main solar system. This information had a huge mental impact on the Vardrags, who are terrified by the mechanoids. Fast, decisive actions were never characteristics of their race, and as usual, they expect their allies to solve the problems. Yeah. Okay, no commendations. If it doesn't get better till Monday, I have to do that. They have to wait this week. Who says? Oh, you, have you already talked to the doctor? <clears throat> oh, okay. I'll walk with the people. Gotcha. Okay, so the Vardrag ships are heading towards Chakras now. Rear Admiral Cromwell, your discovery, apart from causing serious unrest within the chain of command of the Noah colony, has caused real hysteria among the Vardrags. We have never known our patrons to be so nervous. 
They seem really anxious. They have requested immediate help, or to be more precise, they have demanded that we dispatch ships to the Star Portal. Your unit has the most experience in fighting the Mechanoids. Therefore, I'm assigning you to protect the Star Portal. Do whatever it takes to stop the Mechanoids getting through. Yeah, it would help if I could get my battleship back. Nurse there, nurse. Oh, okay. There you go. Finally. Good. Very good. Yeah, okay, so let's start fixing her up. Apparently she was damaged. Why she was damaged, I have no idea. Um, what squadrons does she have? She's got bombers. Uh, I want to equip her with... Let's see. how many. Oh, we have five resource points left. Meteor bombers takes eight. No, uh, okay. Necessary cargo capacity. Uh, three for another squadron of bombers. Uh, I could get another squadron of sickle gunboats. And then... Uh, Cyborg squad. Flash fighters! Damn it. All right, sickle gunboats and spark spark fighters it is. Sure, let's go for it. <clears throat> Francis ship the tactical destroyer Sparta. Uh ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, should we equip the energy skeeter on all of our ships in the fleet, I wonder? Oh, really? But if it, if you have to go with crutches, then you really have to go to the doctor. You know, like, that's, that's not okay. I think I'm not... Just save it here. I think that's actually an okay um, loadout for now. Let's see. Do we have? Oh, we have a personal log. In war, a soldier sees many terrible things. Space, however, is often the exception. The sight of the exploding ships rarely differs from the simulations. It's so much easier when you, can, you can't hear the screams of the dying, when you can't smell the stench of burning flesh, when you can't see the severed limbs and suppurating chest wounds. You only have to face these things if your ship is on, if your ship is the one that gets hit, and by that stage it's normally too late for you anyway. Though the best soldiers try to remember at all times that there are people behind the armored hulls, the suffering of others is far easier to bear than your own. Anyway, forget all that. I'm no philosopher. The sight of the slaughtered ghosts has left me feeling washed out, shaken. All those huge gray-blue carcasses. It was like swimming in the ocean amongst dead whales. The Locust Queen is a tough enemy, and the ghosts are especially defenseless against it in their organic ships. Their independence was their downfall. If they'd only warned me earlier, they might be alive. They might all be alive now. But no, they thought maintaining their camouflage was far more important. Don't they trust me? Why not, damn it? I've never done anything to harm them, unless it's not me they're wary of. Is it Angel that they don't trust? Could they be afraid of her? If so, it could prove a thorn in our side in missions to come. More worryingly, the Vardrags let us know that they are aware of Angel's existence and aren't at all pleased. Oh, boo-hoo. Assimilating the mechanoid has no no doubt added to their paranoia. I hear that in some hawkish circles, there has even been talk of ways to destroy us. Cheerful news. We have to act as soon as possible before our benevolent patrons decide to blow us to stardust. 
Yeah, that was it. Okay, good. Save there. One more time. Alright then. Uh... There's... Alright, well, just be careful and, you know, if it comes to crutches, just contact the doctor. <clears throat> um, we did get a, a briefing, right? I think we got... I'm just replaying the briefing. Just to be safe. Yeah, this is my memory. Not holding up to specs. <laughs> Dear Admiral Cromwell, your discovery, apart from causing... Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's go to it. Or get to it. Cheers. Noah 5, System Noah, Star Portal Base. Oh, that's a big one. <laughs> Targets identified, sir. They are heading towards the star portal. Lieutenant, don't forget that they are no longer our allies. You can put your moral anxiety aside. I know, sir. It's not that. I was just thinking about the mess those cataclysm missiles made of the Rome. They didn't use them at the Alpha Gate. Maybe they won't use them this time either. The Vardrax have provided us with the necessary information to counter the rockets if we have to. Hopefully the Mechanoids haven't had time to perfect their grasp of Vardrax technology. If they have, right. we'll be looking for weak spots in vain. Thanks for the morale boost, Angel. That's just <laughs> what's needed. Right. Pessimism is the foundation of survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. All right, let's see if we can use the siege laser. Uh, I think that's what they might want us to do. Maybe, kind of. Uh, I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to do that. I might also send out Angel in a mechanoid form to... I don't know. Let's check out the freaking... Yeah, okay, so the Serenity is the big problem, most likely. Star Blazer and Pathfinder are escorts. Uh, and the Star Portal is over here. They've activated a Fortress Shield, but that's probably not gonna help them for, for that long. Um, no, 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 no. Hold position. Understood. Uh, all right, let's see if we can use this siege laser. The Guardian still has the siege laser, right? Uh, yeah, siege laser formation. All right, we're gonna go for it and target the Serenity. That's the stronger ships. Stronger ship of the ships. Oh, you get what I mean. That's an energy. Uh, uh, oh, wait. Oh, sorry. There you go. That's Steve's laser for Mason. Understood. What about the Angel Wing? Um, I don't know. Mechanoid, maybe? Dear Admiral Cromwell, we shall do our utmost to support you. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Lerose. <laughs> okay, get into position. Hurry. Aye, aye, sir. Let's go, let's, uh, go over there with the angel wing. Uh, can you turn around, maybe? You're facing the wrong way right now. Uh, 
At least I think they're gonna be able to do the siege laser formation. And please hurry, because they're getting closer. Hurry up. Come on. Maybe I shouldn't use the avalanche. The avalanche is a little bit slower in the siege laser formation. I was thinking... What was the gatekeeper, by the way? Oh, these are our allies. These are the enemies. You can tell by the color of their names. The orange names are our enemies. The green names are our allies. And this, of course, is our fleet. Um, our allies are over here, and these are the enemies that we need to destroy. Come on. Alright, while they get into siege laser formation, I'm going to send out Angel to deal with the Star Blazer, because the Star Blazer is closest. Angel, go get him. In the name of all the sacred, stop those fighters that are mechanized on board. Please, human. Marcus, the Star Blazer has deployed Praetorians, and so has the Serenity. There really are survivors. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Nevertheless, there may be someone left on board. Our data suggests. Really? Are we supposed to scan them now? Uh. Five squadrons of raptors on board these ships, did you? Okay. That there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. All right. So, what do you want us to do about it? Before, sir, I've seen them inflict heavy casualties, even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. But rest assured, we'll follow your orders, even if it means death. If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanoid influence, but they'll be. Whoa. Did they bring down the Holy shit. Did they just become our enemies? Be on their own against raptors and other physical attacks. Thank you, sir. But with all due respect, we are prepared for that. Stop! Okay, so which one should we target? Uh I mean the Star Blazer is the closest one, so but they do have flak cannons, most likely. Aye, aye, sir. Stop them! Shut up! Commandos dispatched. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> oh, wait. Can they actually penetrate the shield? Commando ferry. Nope. Apparently not. <laughs> that was horrible. God damn it. Ah. Uh, wait a minute. Targets identified, sir. They are heading towards the star portal. Lieutenant, don't forget that they are no longer our allies. You can put your moral anxiety aside. I know, sir. It's not that. I was just thinking about the mess those cataclysm missiles made of the Rome. They didn't use them at the Alpha Gate. Maybe they won't use them this time either. The Vardrags have provided us with the necessary information to counter the rockets if we have to. Hopefully, the mechanoids haven't had time to perfect their grasp of our drag technology. If they have, we'll be looking for weak spots in vain. Thanks for the morale boost, Angel. That's just what's needed. Pessimism is the... I love the description here. 
This is another one of those annoying missions. Lots can go wrong and speed is a major determining factor. We have to blow up three we have to blow up the three Vardrag ships in this area, the Star Blazers, Pathfinder, and Serenity. What's most annoying, in my opinion, is the damned Vardrag's voice. Stop there! I can't stand it. It makes me want to break things. <laughs> and then he's like, oh, you can skip dialogue? Just click the dialogue box. But still, it's annoying. Uh, okay. Okay. Somehow through fires and goes. Okay, we're supposed to go guard the portal, apparently. Okay. Oh, we're not supposed to move the Guardian? Oh, they don't recommend us using the Guardian because the Vardrag ships do have Cataclysm missiles and these will take out a heavy battleship in one hit. That tells me that they're always going to fire Cataclysm sh uh, missiles against the uh, Guardian. So ma maybe we should just leave it alone. Um, okay, so this is uh, Stargate. That's the Stargate and that is the Star Portal. Okay. Um... Okay, we're sending fighters to guard the Stargate and the Star Portal. Don't actually know which, what, you know, like, yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> why they have two things, you know? Have the fighters protect the, uh, uh, no, no, protect the, st the Star yes, Portal. Sir. And you protect uh, Understood. the Stargate. Okay, there you go. Now, apparently we're supposed to... Oh, yeah, and Angel Wing, Engine 200, power up there, protect the Stargate. Or Star Portal. Uh, guard the star portal, Affirmative. yeah. And then we do like this. We use the Sparta and the Brutus to guard the avalanche. Understood. And then we set the avalanche to 200 engines. And we attack the nearest ship. Uh, Star Blazer. There we go. Foundation of Survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. We are Admiral Cromwell. We shall do our utmost to support you. That's, uh... That's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz.
We're burning hard for the Star Blazer. Give me ramming speed. Warning, we are under attack. Marcus, the Star Blazer has deployed Praetorians, and so has the Serenity. There really are survivors. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the Raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Was the angel? Oh, there is. There may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties, even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. But rest assured, we'll follow your orders, even if it means death. Shield down. If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanical. Wait, shield down? Oh, on the Brutus. Fuck! Already? Where's the Brutus? Okay. Void implements, but they'll be on their own against raptors and other physical attacks. Thank you, sir. But with all due respect, we are prepared for that. In the name of all the sacred, stop those fighters! There are mechanoids on board! Please, human! No, wait, wait, wait. We still need to destroy the Star Blazer's shield. Why are you... St why have you started firing on... Why are you... Are you firing or are you not firing? No, you're. That's not us. That uh, that's them actually firing on us. Okay. Warning. Shield down. Emergency. Holland. Warning. Ship is being evacuated. What? Okay. Now I'm not following here. He does say that lots, lots can go wrong, apparently. Alright, never mind. Warning. Shield down. Why did he say that we were supposed to... That didn't make any sense. Let's reload. Thank you. No, actually, actually, hang on. Maybe. Um, let's see if we can boost up their. S oh, shit. They need to be fixed. Yeah, confirm. There we go. Thornbird light laser, bubble energy cell. So, what if we do this? We remove Thornbird light laser. I have not had any real use for device destroyers in this game. I, I seem to recall always using, like, you know, the beam weaponry. But this time around... It just doesn't feel like I'm punching through the shields for some reason. I'm just going to go with bubble energy cell here. So we have two. And then I'm going to use particle gatling gun. Yeah, he only has room for one heavy weapon there. Laser globe flag system. Yeah. Uh, What about shield? Shield, 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 shield. Yeah, okay, we can't really... Oh, but what about generators? Support generator, yeah. Six. We'll put one there, there we go. Very good. Confirm. 
Uh, same for the spot for the Brutus. Remove the Thornbird light laser and put another bubble energy shell on that. Uh, particle Gatling gun. Oh shit! Layer shield small. Whose idea was that? Was that? We have jamming shield, not a freaking. Oh, I don't have enough points. God damn it. That's why the Brutus is taking such a beating. It has a weaker shield. Ah. Well, that's not good. And now I can't actually. Ah, oh, fuck. Play your shield small. Alright, fine. I need to br be able to bring down the shields pretty quickly, though. Uh, magma plasma gun. We're gonna... Mm-hmm, okay. He's already got that. We're gonna switch the magmas for... Vulcans, right? Uh... Eliminator Torpedo, Particle Gatling Gun. I'm gonna put Volcano Plasma Gun. Oh, that's a heavy weapon. Of course it is. Alright, we'll put... Gatling gun. Maybe the electron shell. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's try that. That actually brings down. Oh, that should be a configuration that brings down shields pretty well. Um, I'll do Ego 8-1. There we go. Okay. See how we do that now. Okay. Um, like we said, send out the uh, fighters to defend uh, Defend the uh, Stargate Understood. and the Star Portal. Very good. Alright. Now, Angel Wing, burn hard for the station. Engines 200. Guard the Star Portal. There we go. Avalanche. Power to 200. Engine 200. Burn hard. Uh, and bring down the shields of the Star Blazer. Brutus and Sparta. Honestly, you should be able to do the same. But we'll assign you to escort the avalanche first, and then once once you get there, all right. I think everything is looking good right now. Uh, Ego eight one in progress. There we go. Pessimism right. is the foundation of survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Admiral Cromwell, we Wait, let's send out Angel as well. Just have her bring down the freaking Starblazer as quickly. Do our utmost to support you. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Lorenz. Aye, aye, sir. Now 
Marcus. The Star Blazer has deployed Praetorians, and so has the Serenity. There really are survivors. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the Raptors through their task complete. Oh, we don't have any torpedoes here, but yeah. Uh, okay. Alright, keep going. Keep going. See if we can take it take down the hull. Brutus, Sparta. See if we can do that too. Cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. I have to keep an eye on the Starblazer's shield. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. Fuck! The shield returned immediately, right before our torpedoes could actually hit it. All right, never mind. Um, you guys bring down the shields again. Yes, sir. These raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties, even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. But rest assured, we'll follow your orders, even if it means death. If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanoid influence, but they'll be... There we go. Destroy it. Yes, sir. Problem is that we're gonna have to bring the Brutus and the Sparta away from the Starblazer when it goes critical, because allegedly the explosion will destroy them as well. They have pretty big explosion plumes. Be on their own against raptors and other physical attacks. Thank you, sir. But with all due respect, we are prepared for that. All of you... What the hell? Brutus? Angel wing... Yeah, okay. Alright. No, no, no. There we go. I just told you to pound Understood. this one. Focus! Okay. Now. In the name of all the sacred, stop those fighters that are mechanized on board. Fuck. Gonna have to do this again, Starblazer. Alright, well, god damn it. Maybe I should bring the. Okay. Wait. Aye, aye, sir. Warning. Shield down. I get it. Uh, okay. Let's see if we can do this. Understood. Maybe cause a bit of a distraction. Ooh, right. We don't have. We need to use the bombers as well. Affirmative. Emergency. All integrity is critical. Enemy shield has collapsed. Task complete. All right. Affirmative. The Spartan and the Brutus are actually... Maybe I should set their shields to high. Probably should have done that immediately, but yeah. Uh... Okay. Avalanche. Keep pounding that. Warning. Shield down. Stop them! Stop them! How am I supposed to... What? 
Are you serious? Warning. Gunship squadron destroyed. Commandos dispatched. Warning. Our squadrons are under attack. We have lost a fighter. How, how am I supposed to do that? Even with the angel wing, they're not being taken, then we are not able to actually destroy. Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Why not use the guardian? Uh, power engine to maximum guard the star portal and what else Brutus and Sparta put your shields there the foundation of survival are not these your words commander you know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Dear Admiral Cromwell, we shall do our utmost to support you. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz. Okay, let me, th let me think now. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna wait with sending out angels so that we can actually coordinate our attacks and, like, have them happen simultaneously. It would actually work better. About now. Yeah, let's try it. Yes, sir. Warning. We are under attack. Marcus, the Starblazer has deployed Praetorians, and so has the Serenity. Incoming. There really are survivors. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the Raptors through their cybernetic implants. Wait, I'm spotting a pattern here. They're launching Praetorians as soon as we start attacking. As soon as we get into range. Which means we should not attack. We should get our, our, all our defensive forces in place before we actually attack. But let's see how we do this time around. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Nevertheless, there may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties, even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. Alright. Uh... But rest assured, we'll follow your orders, even if it means death. If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanoid implements, but they'll be on their own against raptors and other physical attacks. Thank you, sir. But with all due respect, we are prepared for that. In the name of all that's sacred, stop those fighters! There are mechanoids on board! Serenity has launched a cataclysm missile. Fuck. Okay, we need to... Wait. Ah. Wait, what do we have here? Oh, they're actually attacking the Guardian. And the cataclysm... Okay. Hmm. If the cataclysm missile hits... That the Guardian goes bye-bye. We might be able to pick it out with our flak guns, but... You know. Warning. Shield down. Enemy shield emergency. 
Hull integrity is critical. Task complete. Warning. Ship is being evacuated. Which ship? Fucking Brutus again. What? Okay. Reload. Pessimism. Shut up. Okay, so let's just have the guard. I don't know. Um. Yeah, get. Let's get our. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Avalanche, Brutus, Sparta, hold your position. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz. Maybe, I don't know. Well, they still have a long way to go. I don't know how long I should be waiting for here. I feel like we need to go get moving now. Understood. Firing at their own fighters. What? Warning. Shield down. Not seeing any damage on their squadrons. There's no battle Ooh, going on here. We are under attack. There we go. The Star Blazer has deployed Praetorians. And have probably taken control of the raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Nevertheless, 
There may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties, even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. But rest assured, we'll follow your orders, even if it means death. Is it down? If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanoid imp- Uh-oh. Here we go. Brutus, stay further away. Uh, I don't like this at all. Um, but they'll be on their own against raptors and other physical. Fuck! I don't. Oh shit. Understood. Thank you, sir. But with all complete. Affirmative. Aye, aye, sir. All due respect. We are prepared for that. Aye, aye, sir. Hold position, please. Understood. In position. Warning. Shield down. Understood. Uh, why are you not firing? Understood. Warning. Shield down. Okay, Sparta's shield is also going down. I have to be quick. Fucking shield! Uh, nothing's... This is not working. If all goes well, your fighters and the Angel Wing will manage to save the Star Portal. If not, pull all your fighters back and have all your ships start pounding all the Vardrag ships. Watch out for the shockwaves. Also, there's a survivor on one of the ships. I'm not sure if it's the Serenity or the Star Blazer. I've never managed to save him. You don't fail an objective for that either. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Let's just have all the ships destroy... Oh, and now the game crashed, of course. Let's just have all the ships destroy... Go, go for the fleet immediately. Like, let's count the star portal as a loss. Maybe we're not even supposed to be able to save it. He proposes that it is an option, but... Maybe it's like one of those things that you're not really supposed to save. Pessimism is the Okay. So everybody had for the fucking Star Blazer now. Yeah. Angel Wing, Avalanche, Brutus, Sparta, all of you. Yeah, I don't care. Actually, yeah. Just Go with everything and see what happens. Um, we'll send out the fighters as well. Actually, the fighters might actually... 
Hmm. Yeah, well, okay. The fighters can still protect the star portal. Everything except the bombers. Uh... Protect. Affirmative. And you. Protect. That one. Understood. The rest of you. All of you. Just. Engine speed. Full speed ahead. For. The Star Blazer. Understood. The foundation of survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Rear Admiral Cromwell, we shall do our up. No. Angel Wing, you know where to go. Aye, aye, sir. Most to support you. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz. Oh, good lord. Yes, sir. Dach meda. Yeah, okay, you know what? I might actually have sent out Angel a little too quickly there. Um... Pessimism is Angel Wing, Avalanche, Brutus, Guardian, Sparta. There we go. You guys head for Understood. the Star Blazer. Uh, actually, you can take down the shield yes, for that one. And you, you, and you guard Understood. the Star Portal. You, you, and you guard the Stargate. There we go. The Foundation of Survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Rear Admiral Cromwell, we shall do our utmost to support you. That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz. They're just waiting for the formation, you know? Yes, sir. All right, hold position. Just give the fighters some time to get closer. In position. Yes, sir. All right. Keep going. Uh. Wow. Takes a long time to get into the position. Into formation, apparently. <sighs> In the name of all the sacred, stop those fighters. There are mechanoids on board. Then again, I'm I'm still questioning why are the Vardrag ships still firing on those Raptors? I I don't get it. Would you please step on it? Sir, the Serenity has launched a Cataclysm missile. Aye aye, sir. Warning, we are under attack. 
Okay, everybody defend the freaking guardian. Affirmative. We'll see if we can get it. Marcus, the Starblazer has deployed Praetorian. Nice. Keep firing, keep firing. The serenity. Incoming. There really are survivors. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Being evacuated. Nevertheless, there may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties. Even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient kill. Nope, that didn't work. Well, what if we just fuck the portal and use our fighters to protect the Guardian? Affirmative. Alright. Understood. Pessimism is the foundation of survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Rear Admiral Cromwell, we shall do our... That's, uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Leroz. Whoa, okay. Hey, everybody's burning hard now for... Okay. Brutus, Sparta, you guys put all your guns on shield. Shields. Uh, same with Sparta, yeah. Uh, okay. Ow! Sorry, that was not intentional. Understood. Warning: We are under attack. Hey, VG two four seven. Welcome to the show. Blazer has deployed Praetorians, so has the Serenity. Coming and there really are survivors. The mechanoids are Okay, everybody pound that one. Yes, sir. Could be taken control of the raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls. Aye, aye, sir. Survivors. Nevertheless. There may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before. Yeah, we're gonna have to make sure that the... Yeah, okay. Affirmative. Sir, I've seen them inflict heavy casualties. Even when outnumbered ten to one. They're terrifyingly efficient killers. But rest assured. Wait, why have you turned around? But we'll... Why are they not following my orders? You keep going. Yes, sir. Fucking hell. I made a great opening for you. Follow your orders, yes. even if it means death. Energy low. If necessary, I can protect your commandos from mechanoid influence, but they'll be on their own against raptors and other physical attacks. Evacuate. Thank you, sir. 
Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Let's... Oh. I have an idea. Since the Sparta and the Brutus always go down fighting the Vardrag ships, maybe I should send them to protect the Stargate instead. Yes, let's do that. All the fighters protect the Guardian against Cataclysm missiles. No, not you. There we go, there we go, there we go, and there we go. You protect the ba heavy battleship. Affirmative. Um, Brutus and Sparta, tactical destroyers. We're going to send you to protect... Uh, I don't know. You protect... Yeah, the star portal. Why not? Um, actually, Sparta, you protect the star gate. Affirmative. There we go. Okay, good. So, you will be command group two. Angel Wing, Avalanche, Guardian. You guys are going to be command group one. And you will... Be burning hard for uh, these guys. Where are they? Ah, where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Yes, sir. Optimism is the foundation of survival. Are not these your words, Commander? You know, an artificial intelligence like myself likes to learn new words of wisdom. Yes. Uh, that's just what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Laraz. I wonder if we can... Understood. Do a siege laser thing. Ow! Oh! Yes! This might be a, a bad choice, but I still want to try it. Uh, you know, a... Two in progress? Warning. Shield down. Marcus, the Star Blazer has deployed Praetorians, and so has the Serenity. Incoming. Yeah, that's not. It's not doing that much da uh, damage, though. Unfortunately. The mechanoids have probably taken control of the Raptors through their cybernetic implants. I do not think we should consider these poor souls survivors. Unless we can... There may be someone left on board. Our data suggests that there are five... They are punching through the shields, though. Squadrons of raptors on board these ships. As yet, only one squadron has taken off. I've had to face raptors before, sir. I've seen them inflict heavy casualties. Even when outnumbered ten to one. Come on, they get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Killers. But rest assured, we'll follow your orders. Even if it means death. If necessary, I can protect... Okay, can we also se send out Angel Wing? Yeah... Your commandos from Mechanoid Influence, but they'll be on their own against Raptors and other physical attacks. Thank you, sir. But with all due respect, we are prepared for that. In the name of all the sacred, stop those fighters! There are mechanoids on board! Please, human! We're doing our best.
Enemy squadron destroyed. Shit. Oh. Okay, we're do our squadrons are doing nice. Okay, Star Blazer is gone. Next, uh, the rescue capsules are heading for the base. Shoot them. What? I mean, what the hell do you expect from us? 21, 24. Okay, let's go for Serenity. Yeah, Siege Laser, Serenity. No. Ah. Uh, it's closer, though. Oh, well. The rescue capsules are heading for the base. Shoot them. Shoot them all. Fire, fire, fire. Not bad. Although the Pathfinder did not take any damage from that. Unfortunately. Come on! Are you really that far away? I feel like, let's say, once more, and I can actually uh, experiment a little. Alright, the first thing I want to do is try to actually go there a little bit quicker, get, get a little closer. Wait, 21. Ooh! Pathfinder is actually closer. Understood. Warning. We are under attack. Ah, don't worry about it. Come on, Path Pathfinder's closer. You already had the formation. Don't fuck it up. You're not doing anything. I need that motherfucker. Oh, Sparta, Brutus are under attack. Okay, enough. Go, burn. Oh, for for the love of God! No, if you're if you're using a fleet command, we have to wait for all of us to like actually form up before we can move. Understood. Um, that's only aye, aye, proper. Warning. Just go. They need help. And and now oh, now Brutus and Sp and Sparta are gonna take damage anyway, and probably. Oh, God. Understood. Yes, sir. Enemy shield has collapsed. Uh, Shield down. I know. That's why we're withdrawing the smaller ships. Okay, Angel Wing. Can you send out An uh, Angel again? Pathfinder, why not? No, Serenity's shield is actually down. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. 
Okay. Brutus and Sparta are not being taken down. Okay. Enemy shield has Very nice. Okay. Can you maybe Affirmative. This is interesting. We haven't lost the base yet. I I feel like I want to save once more here. Uh, Eagle four in progress. What is the hold up, guys? Can you just fucking move, please? They're right there. Go get them. Why are you sp fucking spiraling around like this? Oh shit, did I command? Okay, I don't know. Can we siege laser that fucker now? Uh... Excuse me. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, let's see if we can do that. Affirmative. See if he's close enough for that. Yes, please, 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 do it. Do it. Fire. Okay, good, good, good. Keep going. You slowly mo What's the range of the siege laser, I wonder? Oh, nice, nice, nice. Good, very good, very good. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Yes, one more shot. One more should do it. It's not moving that quickly either. Target ship. Yes! Alright. Actually, yeah, let's let's save here. Again. <laughs> I don't want to lose this progress. Uh five. There we go. Perfect. We still have the star portal, the stargate, and all its segments in our control that's great now it's only the serenity left the big city sh city ship let's burn for it baby let's no 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 there we go actually we can take care of you from the inside yeah everybody go for the star portal Enter the shield, and then we'll be able to sit comfy inside and just just shoot out. Where is Spartan Brute? Oh, they're over here. Oh shit! Okay. Wait, we need to. Yeah, okay. Affirmative. Right, I forgot. We actually need to blow up the ship. No, no, we don't need... It doesn't look like it because we... No, these are our fighters. Ah, there we go. Good, 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 good. Alright. Yes, sir. 
Now, everybody, all ass inside the shield. Except for the Spartan Brutus. Where's... Oh, Brutus is over there. Okay, if we can just get everybody inside of the fortress shield. It should be... There should be no problem. The Serenity is on the other side. Please, don't start spinning around like a doofus. Understood. In. God damn it, this is annoying. He keeps fi it Yeah, they keep firing on the Stargate, but... The Stargate does not seem to take any damage. Probably because they're inside the fortress the shield. The cataclysm missile. Where? Oh, shit. Towards us? Wait. Can it actually penetrate the shield? Shouldn't be able to do that. Warning. Shield down. On what? Warning. We are under attack. By what? Okay. Angel Wing, you start dealing damage to the hull. Avalanche, you start dealing damage to the hull. Guardian, you just make sure your big butt ends up inside the fortress shield. Mac can't. Warning. Shields down. Emergency. Hull integrity. Warning. Ship no. is being evacuated. Really? Really? Fuck. It went through the shield. Okay. In position. If... Okay, if we're lucky... No. Wait. Did I only save here? Yeah, I did. Okay. One more shot. Then I guess I'll just... Yeah, there we go. Good, 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 good. All right. We'll we'll have the guardian hold position here then. The avalanche and the angel wing go inside the shield, whereas the guardian just hold position. In position. Yeah, just stay there. Uh, does not break and deal damage. Shield on shield. What do you mean? Oh yeah, we can just go inside the. We'll send out the angel wing once we're inside, or the. Uh, we'll send. We'll send out angel. That should make short work of serenity. Uh no, I mean this fortress shield is. Attuned to let through allies. But they did fire Warning. Cataclysm. Shield down. Oh, apparently, yeah, once we go inside, our shields are deactivated. Because the Fortress Shield is actually protecting us from the inside. Let's see if we can send out the angel. The an the an yes, send out angel. That would be nice. Or maybe. Aye, aye, sir. Warning, we 
are under attack. Yeah, hold position. Yes, sir. Hold position. There we go. Can you just stay here and shoot? This is like a turkey shoot, you know? Manual disarm shields before I do. Nah, that doesn't that doesn't matter. Uh okay. Oh yeah, their shields are down. Okay, fire away, baby. Don't leave the shield. Don't leave the shield. Oh, you idiots. You idiots. You idiots. You're so close. You're such an idiot. Both of you are idiots. We might actually have to move away from this as well. Wait. Oh, hold on. Hold on. I got an idea. I got an idea. Um wait. Yeah, okay. And we're gonna send all the fighters and everything like that to destroy yes, sir. the flak systems first. I want to see if I can send in uh, commandos. See if there are survivors there. I mean, the Stargate doesn't seem to take any damage, so yeah. Target device disabled. Very nice. One flak cannon down. Warning: Our squadrons are under attack. Don't worry about it. Target device disabled. Very nice. Destroy them completely. Good. One down. Two down. Awesome. Now, that one as well. Cataclysm Missile. Take that fucker out. No, don't, don't destroy it. Don't destroy it completely. Alright, I want to send in Cyborg Commandos. Where do we have them? I think they're on the Sparta. Alright, I'm gonna... How many save states haven't I... Do... Wait. Ego 8, 6 in progress. Jesus. Right, I'm gonna send them in right now. Yes, sir. Yeah. See, see how that goes. Commando dispatched. Target ship is being evacuated. Okay, every fighter. Understood. No, not you. Understood. Every fighter. Affirmative. Back to base. Yeah, we've disabled the final enemy ship. Hopefully, we'll be able to see if there's any survivors in there. The Starblazer or the Serenity had a survivor. If it's... 
God damn it. No. 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 Oh, I, I, I went too quickly there. Yeah. Go back. Shut up. Yeah. Re recall all the fighters. Don't let them evacuate the ship. Understood. Aye, aye, sir. Black systems are gone, so they can't shoot down the command squad, commando squad transport ship. Uh, but what the hell are you doing? I said. Aye, aye, sir. Get that bird in the air. Don't tell me you've glitched. All right, fine, we'll go with this one then. Affirmative. Oh, it's because we're recalling the fighters. Okay, I get it. Commandos dispatched. Yeah, there we go. All right. Well, thank you for uh, showing up again, Farty. It's always a pleasure. And yeah, I really should go to bed soon because it's uh, it's 2:40 a.m. here. So I really need just need to do this. Check it out. See if I can find any survivors. And Come after on, that, dispatched. we're uh, yeah. <laughs> It takes so long for this to reach the Serenity because we have actually put the Sparta far away from it. I mean, I don't know what difference that would have made if it's like, we're gonna destroy this ship anyway, so, you know. Honestly, let's Commander have... Lost. 
What? How did we lose commandos? We lost the Angel Wing commandos? Why? What shot the commandos down? I have no idea. The commandos... What? Affirmative. The commandos that we sent weren't even those commandos. The commandos... That was the commandos of the Sparta. But the Angel Wing commandos, we sent them out as an afterthought. And for some reason they got... Just, they, did, they didn't make it. This is confusing, but okay. As one final, let's have let's have the avalanche. No, let's have the guardian do the final thing here. Affirmative. Finish Our off. Commandos are returning. Finish off the serenity. Because the Guardian was always getting picked on, it just feels right to have him, or it, deliver the final, like, the finishing blow. Look at how much punishment the Stargate can take. Let's just get into position. I don't want to fire an out like um what is it you have? Yeah, you you've got pulsar miss missiles or whatever it is. Crisis energy torpedo. Yeah, pulsar missile inside the shield and like the yeah. All right, artillery. Artillery shot. Take him out. She's all yours, Captain Hillary. And there it goes. Bye bye. There it goes. Boom. Uh, what the hell happened? Oh, there's there's another one. Wait, why isn't it? 
Why is it not going boom? It's not going boom for some reason. Is this session glitched or something? Look, he's clearly firing, or it, and the missiles is not missile is not being shot down, but it's not going boom for some reason. All right, then, fine. Close quarters, it is. Yes, sir. Warning, we are under attack. Target ship is being evacuated. Yes, sir. Yeah, careful now. It's gonna blow. No, 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 no. What the hell are you doing? Yes, sir. No! What the fuck is your... What is your problem? Get away from there. God damn it, they were suicidal. Fucking hell. Ugh. All right. Evaluation. The extermination of the infected Vardrags was regrettable, but it was a necessary step to stop the mechanoid infection. The chakra system and the Vardrag race are safe, for now at least. In addition, the defenses surrounding the Alpha Gate are gone, so our route back to Earth is free. We're coming up on the end game, I think. Alpha Gate are gone. Yeah, okay. All right. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this is Chakras. This is the Vardrag's home planet. Wow. Interesting. I never saw it before when I played, you know. <laughs> All right, cool, cool, cool. The ring world, main planet of the Vardrags in the chakra system. Yeah, okay. Save game. Ego 8. There we go. Alright. Cool. Cool, cool. There we go. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is today's session of Nexus the Jupiter Incident. Uh, we, I have no idea how, how long we're going. Um, wait, how many, how many missions are left? I don't know, it seems to be quite, like, a couple still, you know, like, yeah. All right, okay. Anyway, yeah, so that is it for tonight. Thank you for uh, watching. Um, saving the asses of the Vardrags was uh, interesting. Um, this mission, this pa this last mission was a little bit annoying because, you know me, I try to do everything. I try to save everyone. If I can't, I just reload and try again, you know. Um, we actually made it uh, this final time, so yeah. Let's go for it. That is um, applaudable. Appl applaudable. Worth an applause. Anyway, but uh, yeah, we'll see what happens tomorrow when we continue the story. Uh, if you want to, you are most welcome to uh, check out my Discord, which is reachable through this link. That is where you'll always get the latest news and updates regarding the channel, because that is the official Discord of this stream channel, of course. And if you want to check out um, what our status is with the uh, retro games, you can go to this link, 
which is where you'll be able to see where we're at with the retro games, where we have been and where we are going, because there is a bit of a backlog there. Uh, after Nexus is done, I think I'm going to return to uh, playing the uh, next Nintendo 64 game in line. So we'll see what that is. I haven't even checked yet. Um, but uh, yeah, that is it for tonight. I hope you have a good day tomorrow. Uh, remember to uh, stay safe. Remember to mind social distance. And always keep the retro legacy alive. Zegobyte83 wishing you the best. Take care, good night, and goodbye.